Hey YouTube guys, this is Bid9 here and today I'm going to show you that how to pass safety net issue in Magix Manager and also how to root your device with Magix SU. After the last Magix update the 13.21, lot of users are unable to pass safety net and as a result they are unable to play Pokemon Go, unable to use Android Pay, Snapchat and other apps like that which requires safety net to be played. Even I'm also unable to play Pokemon Go in few days in my device, that's why I didn't upload any video in past 2 days. So after searching a lot for 2 days in XDA forums, finally found a way or trick that can be used to pass safety net on our devices. Though you have to repeat this step after every reboot, but still it's quite cool trick to use. We have to use it until the new fixed update comes from Magix himself. So guys, I have done a real hard work behind this so I request you that if you guys found this method to be useful in your device then please give a like in this video for my hard work and also smack that subscribe button so you never miss out exciting and helpful videos like this. So without, oh sorry guys, <laughs> without, with wasting your time, let's get started. So guys, first of all, I'll recommend to you guys to install a custom recovery to your device. So in order to install a custom recovery to your device, just simply uh, go to the YouTube app on your phone and um, wait for it to load and click on the search bar and search for that how to install custom TWRP recovery. Okay, you need to search on that how to install custom TWRP recovery on your device. So I am using Eureka Plus here. So I will type that how to install TWRP recovery. Oh, sorry, I missed V. So TWRP recovery in uh, wait, wait, what is going on? In uh, Eureka, uh, Eureka, oh, shit. <laughs> sorry, guys, uh, Eureka Plus. So how to install custom TWRP recovery in Eureka Plus? So when you search for that, there's a lot of videos on that, how to install TWRP recovery on IYU Eureka Plus, a lot of videos on that. So uh, someone has requested me to do it for Redmi Note 3, he's using Redmi Note 3. So if you need to search for that, just simply clear the Eureka Plus and type there that Redmi Note 3 and click on the search. And when you click on search, there are a lot of videos on that also to be appeared. So if you wanted to install TWRP on your device, just simply tap this and change your name to your device name and then go for that search. So you will find some answers. When you successfully install TWRP on your device, I will put two links, Magix Zip and Magix Manager APK link in video description. Just simply download those two files from there and then reboot to TWRP recovery and install Magix Manager by flashing it by flashing the Magix Zip and install Magix Manager. So when you open Magix Manager on your phone, it's installed Magix version 13.2 here. As you guys can see with 13.2 Magix SU, latest Magix is 13.3 though. So when you do that, make sure just uh, go to the settings up there and what you need to do in this application. Well really you don't need to do anything about here. Just simply uh, go to the red slide and click on the settings and just enable this magic hide option you don't need to do anything just enable this magic hide option when this is done just simply go back and click on tap to start safety net check when you click on it let me just show you so it will show that uh, safety net fails uh, wait a second. Yep, it's showing safety net fails. Uh, CTS false and basic integrity also false. And this is another app, the safety net helper. I, you, I will put that link in description of this app also. You can download it from Go Play Store. So, as you guys can see, it's also showing that the safety net has failed. Just a second, guys. Yep, the safety net has failed up here. So, it's because of the latest Magix update guys in latest Magix there are some implications you know you are not be able to log in with Pokemon Go, Snapchat and other games like other apps like that. So in order to fix this with the latest Magix first install uh, first I have an image for you guys that this is the code that you need to 
paste this code in terminal emulator guys these are commands that you need to enter so how to do this first of all go to google play store and search for this application terminal emulator when you are done just uh, open the terminal emulator on your device and first of all type su to grant the root access so type su and click on enter and when you click on enter a root access prompt will came up you just need to click on uh, agree or grant something then there, there is a main step i will put this image link in video description so you guys can download it from the video description uh, to know the full procedure of, of, about the commands so first of all we need to uh, take down this uh, this uh, commands here so first of all i will type that reset prop uh, wait a second uh, re sorry you type reset uh, reset prop space then uh, click on this one double time and then click on delete and click on space again then type init dot svc dot uh, magisk dot uh, i think uh, magisk said so not dot this one magisk pfs okay magisk pfs so you click on magisk pfs and click on enter and we are done with the first one click on the second one take us again type reset prop here reset prop space uh, this two one again this two again yep and go to delete and uh, space i n i t dot s v c dot magisk and that one and click on p f s d okay p f s d this time you to add a d here p f s d and click on enter again it's done again type reset prop uh, reset prop space again this two this one again and click on delete 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 init dot svc dot magisk service i think yep it's magisk service so you click on uh, init in dot svc dot magisk and this one and click on uh, and type magic service so uh, sorry so if, if vic yep and click on enter again done now when you click on the last line that reset prop space this two again and delete space now, now to type persist persist dot is uh no persist dot magic i think yeah persist persist dot magisk dot hide persist dot magisk what's happening magisk dot hide done click on enter so now you can easily uh, pass the safety net click on exit first and again type exit to exit this common window and now we are done now just simply go to the uh, let me just clear the safety net helper app and let me just go to the safety net helper app again to show you guys that it's working or not so let me click on run safety net test and wait for five to six seconds maybe and yep you guys can see cts profile match true now we can play pokemon go we can play use snapchat android pay and other apps like that uh, so let me just go to the magics manager and tap on the safety net check status again and it will show that it's passed the safety net but guys there's the issue after every reboot you need to do this step otherwise you will not be able to log in with uh, the safety net so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video give a like and subscribe to my channel for more updates thanks for watching see you guys later